In Tesla's second secret plan, Elon Musk has spoken about creating a suitable solution for high-density urban traffic, a factor undeniable in shaping the future of electric vehicles. It could be a utility robo-taxi or even a larger capacity version based on the Cybertruck chassis. But one thing's certain, Elon has nurtured many ideas about a Tesla van over the years. So, will this vehicle bring something special and meet the unique needs of the current market? How does the Tesla van excel in every aspect despite not yet being on the market? In the market, the Tesla van and Chevy Express represent two types of transportation vehicles, each with entirely different operating principles from the perspectives of technology and energy sources. The Tesla van, manufactured by Tesla, one of the world's leading electric vehicle manufacturers, is a transportation vehicle entirely powered by electricity. With the integration of advanced technology and lithium-ion batteries, the Tesla van not only reduces greenhouse gas emissions, but also provides high operational efficiency and lower operating costs. The estimated price of the Tesla van starts at $50,000, excluding taxes and fees. Meanwhile, the Chevy Express is a transportation vehicle powered by internal combustion engines manufactured by Chevrolet, one of the oldest automobile manufacturers. The Chevrolet Express 2024 is priced from $44,900 to $48,600, depending on the model. The 2024 models have seen a significant price increase compared to the 2023 Express, ranging from $1,600 to $2,900, with a typical increase of $2,700 to $2,900. This vehicle uses internal combustion engines fueled by gasoline or diesel, consuming fuel and emitting CO2. Although the Tesla van is priced higher than the Chevy Express 2024 by $1,400 to $5,100 depending on the model, the price difference can be offset by the lower fuel and maintenance costs of the electric Tesla van. When it comes to operating range, the Tesla van is ready to lead with an expected range of up to 400 miles, still outperforming competing electric rivals such as the Rivian EDV and Mercedes-Benz eSprinter, which only have ranges of 150 to 200 miles. On the other hand, GM offers a range of 200 to 300 miles for the Chevy Express. This positions the Tesla van as a more suitable option for long trips, reducing reliance on charging or repair stations. However, expanding this range also implies the need for larger batteries, and the current state of the battery industry may exert pressure on the innovation and competitiveness of the Tesla van. Estimates suggest that the Tesla van may adopt the same battery sizes as the Cybertruck, with capacities of up to 200 kilowatts for the top-end version and 100 kilowatts for the base model. This poses a significant challenge in terms of battery supply. While Tesla focuses on using lithium iron phosphate LFP batteries to save energy and reduce costs, the Tesla van may need to consider employing cobalt-containing battery technology. Being a cargo vehicle, the Tesla van requires batteries with higher energy and lighter weight. Of course, regarding acceleration capabilities, you can also guess that the Tesla van once again asserts its superior position with an impressive time of only 4.6 to 7.5 seconds to reach 0 to 60 miles an hour. This superior acceleration capability provides an exciting and flexible driving experience, especially beneficial for urban commuting. Meanwhile, the Chevy Express appears sluggish with acceleration times ranging from 10.2 to 12.1 seconds. Let's consider the fuel prices and energy consumption of the Tesla van and Chevy Express, and we can clearly see the significant difference in operating costs between these two types of vehicles. For the Tesla van, consuming 28 kilowatt hours of energy per 100 miles is equivalent to a cost of $4.48. In contrast, the Chevy Express requires up to 15 gallons of gasoline for the same distance, with costs reaching $19.15. This highlights the difference in operating costs between the two vehicles. Specifically, the Tesla van saves up to $1,467 per 100 miles compared to the Chevy Express. So the operating cost of the Tesla van is only 23.5% of the Chevy Express for every 100 miles. This clearly demonstrates the economic efficiency of using electric vehicles compared to traditional fuel-powered vehicles. So, what about the design of these two vehicle lines and how's that made a difference in beating the competition? Both vehicles have a boxy shape. However, the Chevrolet Express shows a more rugged and powerful appearance with angular lines, while the Tesla van brings a modern and sleek look with smooth curves reflecting the true Tesla style. 
Both are equipped with projector headlamp clusters integrated with LED daytime running lights, improving visibility at night. Additionally, both the Chevrolet Express and Tesla van offer a wide range of exterior color options, catering to diverse customer preferences. A noticeable difference is seen in the fact that the Chevrolet introduced the Express line in 1996 and created one of the best options for the LCV market, including a passenger carrying variant with seating for up to 15 people inside. This year, GM is expected to undergo a significant redesign for the 2024 Chevrolet Express to inject new life into this legendary truck. With a focus on modernization, the Express will have a more appealing exterior. At the front, the manufacturer adds a horizontal bar across the grille, featuring the bow tie emblem in the middle. Depending on the trim level and options, it offers either larger or smaller headlights, both rectangular in shape and a more aerodynamic profile, highlighted by refreshed lines and an updated front fascia. In terms of size, the Chevy Express measures approximately 224.9 inches in length, 79.53 inches in width, and 94.76 inches in height, with a cargo volume of over 330 cubic feet. Meanwhile, the Tesla van is designed to be larger, capable of carrying lengths of up to 207.3 inches, widths of 79.1 inches, and heights of 85.3 inches. Its cargo carrying capacity can handle loads of up to 10,000 pounds, meeting diverse business transportation needs. With GM's van line, produced for a long time, it's always been popular with its steel body and plastic mud guards. The frame is made of reinforced steel, ensuring protection in the event of a collision. The front suspension is of the strut type and the rear suspension is of the leaf spring type. Inheriting the latest design from its successor, the exterior of the Tesla van is particularly distinctive based on the Cybertruck using stainless steel. It's speculated that Tesla will use silver white metal panels similar to those on the Cybertruck. The Tesla van is expected to have a more rugged design rather than the usual sleek lines. Stainless steel frame will also be deployed to provide solid protection in the event of a collision or damage, although some adjustments may be needed to meet all the requirements of truck, such as the 17-inch air suspension system. In addition to Tesla's innovations, we expect the interior of the Tesla van to maintain the modern style commonly seen in other electric truck models, with the ability to transport from 8 to 15 people or carry cargo up to 400 cubic feet, the Tesla van can meet various usage needs. With a maximum payload of up to 5,000 pounds or even higher depending on the final battery type Tesla chooses. Tesla proposes variants with only front seats and passenger seats, providing flexibility for those who want to experience a van life on the road. With autonomous driving capability, users can customize seating for use at home or choose a configuration without seats to turn the vehicle into a mobile home. Tesla aims to create a truck that can serve people with disabilities, integrating features such as integrated hill descent and wheelchair seats. For wheelchair users, stepping into a Tesla vehicle in a crowded urban environment is no longer a nightmare. Furthermore, the Tesla van is ready to integrate autonomous driving capabilities, evidence of Musk's focus on developing robo-taxis and improving the Tesla van. In early November, Elon Musk announced the upcoming launch of Tesla's fully autonomous FSD version 12, expected to come out in the next two weeks. Musk's optimistic timeline trend may surprise many, but signs indicate that Tesla is making significant strides in deployment. To avoid falling behind competitors when introducing a new vehicle line, Chevrolet understands the importance of providing numerous options to meet diverse customer preferences. The 2024 Chevrolet Express may offer multiple trim levels, each providing a distinct set of features and amenities. From lower trim versions focusing on practicality and functionality to higher end models with luxurious touches and advanced technology, there will be an Express model suitable for every need. Comprehensive safety features are expected to be included, such as adaptive cruise control, lane keeping assist, automatic energy braking, and blind spot monitoring. Entertainment options may include touchscreens, smartphone integration with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, and premium audio systems. Additionally, convenient features such as keyless entry, power adjustable sliding doors, and rear view cameras are expected to be available in various equipment levels. What motivated Elon to steer the development of the Tesla van towards a Tesla camper direction? To outshine competitors and enhance the diversity of the Tesla brand, Elon Musk envisioned the Tesla van not just as a commercial vehicle or family utility, but also as a revolutionary electric camper. The goal behind this endeavor is not only to cater to the camper community, but also to redefine the camping experience 
by providing customizable interiors that astonish buyers. During the summer season, the Tesla modular interior seems poised to bring an electric camper to market faster and potentially at a lower cost than competitors like Winnebago. Furthermore, Tesla offers a full catalog of customizable parts for your truck. Whether you want a mobile office or a bike hauling camper, to acquire one of these vans, you'll have two options. Pay $125,000 up front or sign a 12-month contract and pay $2,300 per month, $27,600 per year to reserve the truck. Unfortunately, if you decide to purchase the truck, the rental payments won't apply to any purchase transactions. The company is also looking to sell a version capable of driving 250 miles on a single charge. If you reserve a truck, you'll receive a new one upon production. The innovative changes in the living space of Tesla vans are poised to make Elon's company stand out from the competition. By developing a modular interior system similar to the visionary concept of grounded outstanding camper interior, featuring modular blocks for storage, kitchen, bed and bathroom, Tesla aims to offer customizable camper interiors that astonish buyers and transform their approach to camper purchases. The interior of Tesla vans is likely to feature sustainable Baltic birch wood reinforced with aluminum structures. If Tesla opts for a modular interior, it could potentially create unique vans quickly and at lower costs, avoiding the possibility of two identical trucks. As a result, Tesla vans may undercut competitors significantly in terms of pricing, stemming from simplicity and the materials themselves. However, simplicity is only one aspect. The sole tank on board is a 16-gallon water tank complemented by a dry flush toilet if needed eliminating the need for complex plumbing systems. Power for the living quarters of these vans is sourced from a 640-watt solar-powered lithium battery, which can be upgraded to a larger capacity upon request. All electrical appliances are powered through Tesla's proprietary electrical system and controlled via the Tesla app. Software monitors your electricity usage over time, optimizing energy usage to extend battery life. Another interesting feature is the ability for the home battery pack to charge the van's battery in emergencies allowing for a few extra miles of driving. What's the reason behind the delay in producing that Tesla van? The production of Tesla vans is currently focusing on a large workload at the beginning of the year. In January, the company introduced a notable Model 3 for the U.S. market. Additionally, a high-performance variant called the Bombshell is expected to be launched in May, simultaneously in both the U.S. and China. With these developments, Tesla is actively expanding the scale of Cybertruck production and preparing for product launches starting at the end of the year. Therefore, the assembly and production of Tesla vans might not happen until 2026. While Tesla's van production may be delayed until after 2026, competition in the electric truck sector is becoming more dynamic than ever with Volkswagen and Kia aiming to release their models in 2025. Volkswagen's preparing for the release of the ID Buzz Microbus, expected to cost around $50,000. This vehicle is expected to be equipped with an 86 kilowatt hour battery, with a charging time from 10 to 80 percent in just 30 minutes. In terms of technology, Volkswagen is heavily investing in solid-state battery development, promising to expand operating range by up to 20 percent compared to traditional lithium-ion batteries and reduce fast charging time by 30 percent. This puts pressure on Tesla to continue investing heavily in research and development, maintaining its leading position in the electric vehicle industry. Meanwhile, detailed information about Kia's first K-Van remains tightly guarded, only known to come with three different models named PV1, PV5, and PV7. On the other hand, long-standing rivals such as Ford Z Transit with a starting price of $40,000 lower than the anticipated price of Tesla vans, estimated at around $50,000. Price competition puts pressure on Tesla to offer a more competitive price to attract customers. Additionally, the extensive service network of competitors makes it easier for customers to maintain and repair vehicles. Tesla also needs to expand its service network to meet the increasing demands of customers. With competitive pressure, Tesla may have to adjust its production strategy, focusing on areas with higher profitability or larger market share, such as the Model 3 and Model Y electric vehicles. Meanwhile, Elon's desire to focus on developing the next generation of the Model 2 Redwood is aiming for 20 million units by 2030 for Tesla. Delaying the production of Tesla vans may occur to concentrate resources on other important goals. However, the global electric van market is experiencing exponential growth, projected to reach a staggering US dollar $63.8 billion by 2027, with a compound annual growth rate of 22.5%.
Tesla's contribution to this growth is significant, as the Tesla van operates with zero emissions, thereby reducing carbon emissions and air pollution. Transportation, responsible for 29% of greenhouse gas emissions in the United States, according to the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, stands to benefit greatly from such advancements. Moreover, the rise of autonomous vehicles is reshaping the automotive landscape. Predictions say that 80% of the value of self-driving cars will come from commercial applications like delivery services and logistics. Here, Tesla's potential integration of advanced autopilot technology into the Tesla van could revolutionize these sectors, enhancing both safety and efficiency. Studies suggest it could lead to a 20% reduction in traffic accidents and a 15% improvement in fuel economy for commercial fleets. In the global van market, Segmented into cargo vans, passenger vans, and pickup trucks, the cargo van segment holds the largest market share at 42%. Tesla's modular interior design caters to this diverse market, offering a maximum cargo capacity of approximately 150 cubic feet for cargo applications, comparable to leading cargo vans like Ford Transit. For recreational purposes, it can seamlessly transform into a comfortable camper van, tapping into the growing $8.3 billion RV industry in the U.S. Tesla's software-driven approach ensures that the van stays cutting edge, delivering up to 30% more value to customers through features and functionality improvements over time, as suggested by McKinsey and Company. Integration with Tesla's ecosystem allows for remote vehicle management and over-the-air updates, further enhancing user convenience. With the Tesla mobile app boasting over 24 million monthly active users. Additionally, the Tesla van's commitment to sustainability extends to its use of eco-friendly materials including recycled and recyclable materials. This aligns with the glowing global market for recycled plastics in the automotive industry, expected to reach 9.3 billion US dollars by 2025. Furthermore, its potential integration with solar panels or charging infrastructure could further reduce its environmental impact, aligning with the projected growth of the global solar energy market to 2.1 billion US dollars by 2027. In the face of such advancements, traditional automakers are challenged by the disruptive potential of the Tesla van, as new entrants like Tesla and Rivian dominate the global electric van market. This dynamic landscape underscores the transformative impact of electric and autonomous technologies in shaping the future of transportation. We hope you'll experience the utmost relaxation after watching this video. If you did, please hit the like button and join the Tesla car world community by subscribing to our channel. Hit the notification bell icon to stay tuned for any fantastic videos coming your way. Your feedback and time are highly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Until then, stay safe and enjoy.